Hey boo boo kitties, hey boo hey. In today's tutorial, I'm gonna be showing you how to create this typing effect on your pocket camera in CapCut. So let's jump right into it. I already have this clip here. This was years ago, you guys, when I went to Rome, Italiano, Rome, Italy. So what I'm doing right here, you guys, I noticed that the clip wasn't as enlarged to, to fit the entire, uh, ratio so i'm just kind of enlarging that really quick before we get started so don't mind me okay so now that i've done that you've imported your desired clip in CapCut. this is where i want the text i'm gonna click text add text now i'm gonna type in a random title for the purpose of this video let's do when in rome vlog but i want vlog to be one of my pairing fonts so before we add vlog underneath, we're going to go and change the font to courage, you guys. Now we're going to swipe over to styles because I want a black outline. So to the right of that circle there, you guys, with the slash, you'll have this outline like this. You can play around with the other outlines, black outline, yellow outline. But as you can see there, now I'm just going to drag this text to the remainder of this clip. And when it comes to branding, you really want to do like a font pairing and be consistent. So my two font pairings are always courage and constant. So now what I just did, I just highlighted the first text we added, press duplicate, and then drag down the copy that I just made. Now I'm going back into the text. I'm going to change the font to constant. Now I'm going to swipe over to effects, not styles, effects. I'm going to hit pink. And then I'm going to choose this neon glow, which I love here. And now I'm going to go and change the name to blog. So you can change the name first, then go in and change the font, add effects. I just did it backwards. So we're going to do this. Let me just make this smaller. And you can really just do it whatever is appeasing, whatever is appealing to your eye you want to drag this to the right or have this center i'm just going to have this center like this okay so now i'm going to highlight the text when in rome and then we're going to go to animations now do you see under animations there's in out and loop right we're going to be under in you're going to see right to the right of the circle with the slash is a typing effect it's called typing cursor i just swipe to out because i want this text to enter the scene i want this text to enter the clip typing and i want it to exit the clip typing right now i did the same thing with blog i just highlighted blog i just tapped blog the text and we're under the category of in when the clip is going to enter the clip when the text is going to enter the clip so i'm just going to choose a random animation Okay, I forgot to do out, so let's just go back to vlog. I'm going to tap on vlog. I'm just seeing how everything looks good. Okay, boom. We still haven't added the typing effect altogether, okay? I'm going to highlight vlog, go to animations. This time, instead of under being under in, I'm going to swipe over to out because I want this text that says vlog to exit with an animation as well. So let's just see how this looks. And I only wanted the top to have the text. You can have all of your text have the I only wanted the top text to have the typing effect. Y'all feel like I'm doing a tongue twister, so I'm sorry if I'm getting the words mixed up. Okay, I only wanted the top text to have the typing effect. Now what I'm going to do, you guys, I'm going to go over to audio right here. Audio, sound effects, and you are going to type in typing sound, okay, or typewriter. Let me see. Yes, it's typing on keyboard. I already bookmarked the sound, so it's going to be under typing on keyboard. So you're going to make sure that right at the end when the when the typing stops you're going to press split and then we're going to drag all the way here when the typing starts again and then we're going to split right here and delete the remainder because if you leave this on for the entire clip you're going to hear the typing noise without the typing and i only want the noise to to be heard when i'm actually when the typing effect is active as you can see so that is it booboo kitties it's super easy just make sure that when you add the typing cursor effect the visual you want to add the sound as well so that it's like this make sure to subscribe booboo kitties